Hi guys, Gilliam Elliott here with an educational video about medical tourism. Today I want to talk about choosing the right hotel for your medical tourism clients. So with so many things you have to deal with as a medical tourism facilitator and organizing the trip and coordinating and arranging uh, certain aspects of the trip, a lot of times you can forget about the hotel and the importance of the hotel. So when you choose a hotel, one thing you want to keep in mind is to make sure that the hotel is in close proximity or close distance to the healthcare provider that the patient will be getting treatment from. So you want to make sure the hotel isn't way across town. God forbid if the patient needs to go to the hospital or the clinic uh, because an emergency happens, you want to make sure they don't have to travel a far distance to get to the healthcare provider in a scenario like this. Another thing you want to make sure is that the hotel is in a safe area and make sure that the staff is aware of your medical tourism patient and the accommodations that they'll need. So when the medical tourism client shows up to the hotel, you want to make sure the staff's aware of this because they're going to need certain things that other guests might not need. So so one thing you need to make sure of is that this hotel has rooms that are handicap accessible. Now, if you're dealing with patients who need a dental procedure or a non-invasive procedure, then that's one thing. But if you're dealing with clients that are getting major surgeries, they're going to need certain accommodations in their hotel room. So make sure the rooms are handicap accessible and also make sure that wheelchair accessible. Like I said, if this patient is getting a major surgery, they're going to need certain things in their restroom to take showers. They're going to need bars, ramps, etc. So make sure the hotel has rooms that can accommodate someone with limited mobility and someone who has handicaps. Also, if this patient doesn't speak the native language of this country, you want to make sure someone at the hotel speaks their native language and can be on staff when the patient comes to the hotel. And you know, if your patient is getting a major operation, they're going to spend a lot of time in their hotel room uh, recovering. So the hotel is really important. So I want to encourage you guys. I know there's a lot of moving pieces in medical tourism and there's a lot of things that you have to coordinate and organize, but don't forget choosing the best hotel for your clients. Because depending on the operation, the patient's going to spend a lot of time in their hotel room recovering. So keep these points in mind when you're considering hotels to work with. And also, if you guys are looking for more information on the subject, we cover it extensively in our certification program. I'm also going to leave some links below where you guys can get in contact with me if you have any other questions. But thank you so much for watching this video.